Good morning, YouTube. We just woke up from a lovely nap in the purple bed because my favorite color is purple. Now, as you guys can tell, I'm currently not wearing a helmet or boots. My feet are getting sore. And my head, well, I'm just, I'm getting too tanned and I kind of need a helmet to protect that. So, that's what we're going to be doing. I gotta finish up my stuff here. And then I also actually have kind of a stupid idea that I kind of want to do. I'm thinking about building a huge pumpkin beside our automatic pumpkin farm. Just because I'm weird and I feel like it's kind of a, a cool, a weird thing to do to add beside it. Just to add on to a world, making a 10 by 10 pumpkin just right there. Then at least when you look at that, you know it's a pumpkin farm. Or I just did it for no damn reason. And I'm really hoping I didn't do it for no reason. And I'm hoping this is not just Unbreaking 3. Protection 3 and Unbreaking 3. That's better. That's better. My first set of armor that I got was a piece of poop. Like, I'm really not impressed with anything. Like, my chest piece is only Fire Protection 3. My pants are only Unbreaking 3. My spoon is only Fortune 2. My sword's okay. My pick's really good. And my Diamond Axe is only Unbreaking 3. So not too impressive. My pick I'm super happy with, I probably really wouldn't change a thing except for efficiency 5 maybe. But other than that I'd probably keep it pretty much the same, I'm not going to complain with that. Nothing really to complain with. Um, we should definitely breed our cows. Our cows need to make babies. They need to look at each other in the eyes and say, baby I love you, make sweet tender love for me. And create little itty bitty moomoos. So I'm gonna go do that. I'm gonna make itty bitty moo moos. Cause I need the food and I want the leather so I can actually bring my enchantment room inside. Cause I don't want it to be outside no more. I feel like some of my enchantments are getting kind of messed up. So maybe that'll be the next episode. We still need to finish up this area with all the wood, the walls. Um, we need to clear out this area. And we just need to tidy it up a little bit more before we keep continuing to do stuff. Because, like, I'm, I'm not really getting anywhere. Kind of just staying similar. And I feel like people are going to call me a noob because I'm on episode 9 now. Well, I mean, the episodes aren't really just episodes. It's just so you guys can watch things in order. That's why I'm numbering them, or I'd probably just keep doing random stuff. Make babies, cows. Come together, fall in love. Make babies now, please. Make babies. You, you breed. Make babies. Yes, yes. Look at all them hearts. Oh, so much love going on inside of here. So much love. This is what we need in the world. Love and happiness. Families make the world go round. Oh, I didn't even get them all. Okay, the maximum amount. Slaughter. 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 Ooh, headshot. Slaughter. Don't run into other cows, burn them. Don't be like that, Bessie. Don't be like that, Bessie. That's my horse. That's Juju. Juju needs a name tag. Oh, didn't Juju get a name tag? Juju does have a name tag! That's Juju the horse. Uh, I don't think me and Colin ever recorded any Minecraft in our one world. Um, but I had a horse named Juju, and now Juju is back. Oh, I thought I swatted Juju. I almost cried. That's baby cow. Well, I'll feed the rest of them up then. Breed a little bit more. I did just slaughter a lot of their family. I wish I had looting though. If we had loot, I can't even see. There's the gates. There's the gates. Yeah, I can't even see down there. That's that's getting kind of crazy. I love looking at this pumpkin farm from from so far away too. It's so nice. Like if you run all the way. 
back here to where this pillager outpost is, which I wish you could care because I kind of want to make it my watchtower. But like if you're back here, like look at that thing. That's all just a pumpkin farm. Automatic. I don't got to be near it for it to work. It just harvests me pumpkins for me. Super titty boy, I'm not going to lie. Check and see how many pumpkins it's actually giving me. Yeah, like, that's that's a shit ton of pumpkins. That's more pumpkins than I will ever already just find use for, so. Wicked. Wicked, wicked, wicked. But now, let's go build this big 10x10 pumpkin beside the pumpkin farm. Keep progressing this Minecraft world with some dumb shit. Look pretty cool in the future. 10 by 10 pumpkin, 10 by 10 pumpkin. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 2, 3, 4, oh, shit. What's the best thing to harvest pumpkins with this spoon? Or was I 2, 3, That's right, pumpkins need a bottom. What's that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Rip this all the way back. Which I ran out of dirt, but that's that's an easy solution. Easy solutions. Give me some dirt. Not snowballs, though, boys. We don't care about no snowballs. Okay, we got 34 dirt. That should be good enough to make our way all the way around. Pumpkin this out. To where? Is this where it ends? Start building this over. There, now this can just be all pumpkin. There, now it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we gotta do that all the way around, and then we have our big 10 by 10 pumpkin. I think this is actually gonna look pretty awesome. I'm pretty hyped because I'm a part. I'm OVL. October's very own. Let's go, Halloween. That shit hurts taking fall damage every damn time, though. I feel like there should be a better way to do this instead of me just. Plopping and taking fall damage every damn time because that's it's starting to hurt. Look at it, it's so massive. And I was gonna even make it bigger. Which that's the good thing about this part too, though, it's easily extendable. Like I can just keep making that to the sky or all the way to bedrock, like if I really, really, really wanted to. It's not hard at all. If you guys want a tutorial on how to make that pumpkin farm, let me know. It works for... What am I trying to say? It also works for melons, and I'm pretty sure I can make it work on sugar cane as well. Sugar cane just... It might be a little bit differently done, and you would not need any spaces. You just have to give the bottom... Uh, one gap that way it destroy the it when it grows its second one high But I'm pretty positive that I could do it I don't know I'm gonna experiment with it because I'll probably make one because the last sugarcane automatic farm that I had Was a little bit of a nightmare to work and run around so I'll be looking for an easier one So I'll try to take that base of a redstone and try to use it on the sugarcane and see how well it works It may work a little bit, but it might not work well 
I kind of want it to work well. We'll see. We'll see how everything goes. One step at a time. Just worry about what we have right now in this Minecraft world and take it from there. Also, guys, if you want to see something else, just leave it in the comment section below if you want me to build something in this world. Um, we can definitely do it as a project. I want this world to be everybody that ends up watching this series. We all just add in and make it our own flair and our own little style. So there's the ginormous pumpkin so far. That's going to that's gonna look pretty good. I like it. Maybe we could build like a secret entrance into it with like some sort of redstone contraption for the door. Um, and actually store our pumpkins in there. Maybe we could change our pumpkin holder from this to that. I feel like that actually be a pretty cool idea. A pumpkin holding all our pumpkins. Let me know what you guys think. Might not be that fire up. I think that'd be kind of sick to be honest with you. But I'm really not too sure. And I'm trying to just record pretty much whatever I do for the YouTube now because most of the stuff that I've actually just sat and recorded has been for my base, you know, building my base and stuff. And I want this to be fun, so I'm going to start building stupid shit like this, like random stuff, just so it's more entertaining for you guys to watch. And this world will get plastered and full, and then we can look back at it in a couple months, maybe even a year, and see how much we've grown and all the changes. Well, YouTube, there it is. There is our big old pumpkin beside our big old automatic pumpkin farm. Now, let me got like let me know guys if you actually want to see me make this the chest room for all the pumpkins that come out of this instead of going over there. Let me know if we should put them in there. We should make a storage room in there. I think that'd be kind of a cool idea. But for now, this is all that I have to offer for this episode, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you did enjoy this. And stay tuned for all our next Minecraft episodes in this series. Lots more dumb stuff to come your guys' way. A lot more weird and random buildings. Just doing this for fun, man. That's all this is about. But if you guys did enjoy, please subscribe. Um, and peace out until next time.